So, words of wisdom here. This elder statesman actually dropped massive, massive words of wisdom in this video. Not just in politics about this Edo election, but generally about the country. And Dele Farotimi specifically called out APC and everything they've been doing here in the country. Well, he had an interview with Central News TV and yeah, they gave him an open space for an inter interview that he has to open his mind. I know you guys always like to listen to these guys and all their wisdom. And Ugwezi J. Ugwezi speaks on the powers of politics in this country. And I believe he was referring straight up to the election that took place on Saturday, the 21st of September 2024 in the city of Benin and its environment. And well, let me not say too much. I'm just going to allow you guys take a glimpse of everything they say here. Then you drop your comments below, guys. To what Oshio Amole said, join us. Come to the APC and your sins are forgiven. Impunity, the knowledge that nothing will happen. We can do anything we like and not and what has happened? Nothing has happened. Nothing has happened. How do you feel about the government's recent ministerial appointments? Have any of them surprised you? They've been extremely successful. It was always their job to tax us, to assail us, to make the Nigerians' life intolerable. I had no expectation of either them or the person who has appointed them. What was the purpose of their appointment? Come and chop. When I look at someone like Mr. Matawali or whatever that one calls his name, being the one, the one, the even Bandit says that he's one of them. That's the one that is busy, they're calling the Minister of Defense. When you look at it, it's always very easy to be outraged by the insanities that we have normalized in our country. But I have found that it would only be a sense of selective outrage that will lead me to look at Matawale and be angry. Who am I supposed to look at from the president to the Senate president? To who, who am I supposed to look at within the Nigerian governing establishment and find some inspiration for hope? Who? What do you have against the Senate president, by the way? How many charges was it that he had with the EFCC before it became canonized by the Buhari government? Isn't that the same man that was being chased into the government house in his former state. Are you at that point where you think... No, I don't believe hopeless? Nigeria's case is hopeless. No, no, no. The system is hopeless. Mm. You cannot reform our existence. It is important for people to understand that the dynamics that control politics are different from just ordinary dynamics. Most of the times when you look around in political circles, you will discover that the people who are ruling are not actually the people that are qualified to rule. One way or the other. The people who presumably are qualified to rule do not always make it to that position or the positions. But the people who visibly are not qualified by the standards of people. The people who are presumed not to be qualified to rule are always the ones who will always seize those positions and they are the ones that are ruling. When you look at this, you will think uh, it is something that just started. If you think it just started, you are wrong. If you read a lot of the books written by the ancient philosophers, you will discover that this has always been the problem of philosophers. Why is it that the qualified never get to rule, but the unqualified are the ones who are ruling? Not just that they are ruling the qualified, they are the ones that are deciding not only the future of the qualified boy, but they are deciding the future of the children of the qualified. It is something that uh, it cuts beyond just the ordinary dynamics. There are strong dynamics that control political development and political decisions and the political mechanisms. And until we, we rise above the sentiments of thinking that it is all about 
making noise and understand that we must have to rise beyond these dynamics to actually understand why this is happening. Uh, we may continue in this rigmarole of just moving round and round and round and round. <laughs> and then we, we will keep counting ourselves as we are the qualified. And then we will keep seeing the people that we believe are not qualified. Seizing the power. <laughs> Even when they say that the kingdom suffered violence, but the violent ones take it by force. It may not be direct reflection of this, but it has element of these dynamics. Why is it that they will always take it by force? The people that are not qualified and they are deciding your future and you say you are qualified. Rise above that sentiment and understand why that dynamics is like that. These philosophers of old, if you read the ancient scrolls of philosophers, you will see that it was listed as one of the problems of the ancient philosophers. Why is it that the qualified never gets to rule? And we are seeing the same thing. <laughs> Laughable. <laughs> Laughable. I am just saying in a piece of my mind, many people will not understand what I am saying here. And if you are among those who have not managed to understand, just go. But if you believe you know the reason or you can demystify the dynamics, then you may leave a comment. Have a wonderful day. Ayaka. Uh, no. It's a I'm going to Is you got one in the one. Is you got one in the one. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. I do yeah, yeah, classic to that. You have a mini version of Las Vegas. Every person on our chat, Jackie, on Kino, on Quasso. A mini version of Las Vegas. And then Nigeria had a boggy. I give you job, I give you my room, and I call all those things. So I, I, I didn't deliver. I bought from everywhere, and I didn't deliver. I can, but you are loved everywhere, and then I'm just not going to go everywhere. I'm going to go. Uh huh. Go, but you are not going to Nigeria. You are going to be like Nati. Can you buy a car? I know. I know. I want to just go to New York. I want to just go to New York. I want to 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 go to New York. Atlantic City, New Jersey. Yeah, that's lovely. This is lovely. This is, this is the heart, heart of uh, New Jersey. Yeah, but this is a busy fashion of Las Vegas. I've been to Las Vegas and uh, all these hotels that are here, all of them are, are, are Las Vegas. Uh, Yes. Oh, your first time now, Atlantic City. This is my first time in Atlantic City. Yes. Oh, no, you have to come more often. This is my first time uh, in Atlantic City. Yeah. On a, on a, we were talking about last night, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you so much, my brother. No, no, my brother. Thank you for coming. You'll be coming more often, eh? Oh, okay. okay. The next time you got here, you know, I got quite a dog one. Can you get a reception as a celebrity? I am actually a priest, bro. I am the priest. Dalo. You didn't even celebrate to never celebrate. Yeah. Dalo, my brother. Dalo, my brother. Thank you. God bless. Get in ready. Get in ready. Yes.